Why, hello there, viewers. It is me and the Grumman Goose, a bush plane, which <laughs> anyone who's flown with me in single in the multiplayer flights of Marex knows I am proficient at extremely. They break this plane in and out of anywhere. Alright, let's start her up. Mm. Call up our little panel here. Main battery. Mixtures on. Controls free. A movement. Alright. Go pump. Clear prop. Clear prop. This is what I think is a sound glitch for Flight Simulator X. Looks like we'll take off Pompano Beach parking right there and head for. Again, I forgot the program is in. But we'll take the long program in. <laughs> and, folks, since this is a water plane, this is an amphibious aircraft. I'm going to be doing an amphibious air, uh, what airport? You know, it's just an airport that's a bunch of water. Look at the ground goes turn around. Didn't even miss the tailwheel. This is a technique I commonly use for majorly short field takeoffs I'm going to use here. And we'll also going to do this, Avionics Master. Here we go, taking off. Wheel the wheels up, eat up air on. Say goodbye to your flaps and gear, because they're already raised up by the time you take off, usually. Approach lock. You kind of want to hold this up till they, till the elevator trim really kicks in, because the nose will sometimes go drop all the way down. Yeah, very annoying. And I'd like to take a vote. Who would like to see? I don't think me and my friend are doing. We're doing like an like an air shows thing with the with the. 
the B-17, like we flew all the way from Princess Juliana, Miami, did like an air, like a mock air show, put music on, and uh, we're gonna head to Houston on a mock air show tour. If uh, you guys want me to record it, I'll set it up. I just hit my approach line, and my approach line is set to GPS. Yeah, it's set to GPS. Why are we not on GPS route? Now, see, this happened to me twice today. I program in a flight plan and it doesn't punch it in. Alright. There we go. And uh, back to the destination we had. Alright. En route. Save it. Do not turn me to the airport, my heart. Ah, oh, look at that beautiful water. Now, I could be just taking off and landing in the water, but I'm not like that, man. I take you to the neat spots. There's your landing gear crank. <laughs> Shouldn't be too long of a trip. Nope, 13 minute long video then. Oh, we haven't gotten in the way yet. Oh, this is the life, guys. You know? Flying along. And yep, it's the Grumman Goose. A Lucy Goosey. I guess that's control cables, I can shut off my fuel. Folks, destination revelation. We're heading to Miami to SPB Seaplane Base. That's right. Taking this plane is amphibious aircraft to a water strip. I mean, if you don't take it to a water strip, it's a crime. Because how are we going to demonstrate the awesome look of the floats down? Good time here. Yep, eight minutes. <laughs> First video you when you know it's probably gonna be over. And there was a, like a Grumman G21, which is the original model, which 
at fixed floats, this is the D2NA, which has retractable floats. So, like, when I'm done, when I land, come in to land, you should be able to see the floats come out, drop down out the window. texture for this aircraft. Stock. It's stock texture and it looks pretty good, doesn't it? Can't open the windows like you can in the B-17. <laughs> but yeah, it's up to you guys and this will be the last video for about two weeks. I know, sad face. You were liking these videos, I could tell. Yeah, it'll be the last for about two weeks. In that time, Josh will be back. And then he'll have a good charger cord and stuff. And That's Miami International right there. Which means Miami SPB is right ahead. Right, folks, we have a Twitter page, the Ace at Motto. Watch P38 video for the actual name of it. It's up three followers. Thank you to those three followers who are currently following our chat, uh, the channel's Twitter page. Thank you very much. We appreciate the views and followers. I think it's Western. I don't know. But anyway, let's take a look at again. There's Miami down there. Beautiful Grumman Goose. Well, I'm liking this texture. The white really does look good. As for Miami Dade SPB, uh, there's no real buoys mark in the runway or anything, so you just come in and land basically. What? No. No, it's one of these switches. No. 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 